using the cubit fluorimeter. Bring to the core facility your sample, pipette tips, and pipetters. We will provide a dilution buffer, standards, fluorimetric reagent, cubit specific assay tubes, and a quick start guide. To prepare your sample, we'll begin by making a master mix of our dilution buffer and fluorimetric reagent. For each sample, you'll need 199 microliters of dilution buffer. Make sure to include enough for excess and the two standards. To the dilution buffer, add our 200x fluorimetric reagent, one microliter for each of your samples, the two standards, and however much excess you've chosen to make. Swirl the master mix. For each of the standards, add 190 microliters of fluorometric master mix to each tube. For your samples, you'll add between 190 and 199 microliters of the master mix, depending upon the dilution that you've chosen to use. For each standard, add 10 microliters. 10 microliters of standard one into the standard one tube. And 10 microliters of standard two into the standard two tube. Sample dilutions may use between 1 and 10 microliters depending upon how concentrated you anticipate your sample being. Make sure you label each tube. This is particularly important if you are measuring multiple samples. Vortex each sample to combine well. Then incubate for 2 minutes. When you're ready to quantify your samples on the qubit fluorimeter, begin by selecting your assay type. Next, you will make a two-point standard curve. Insert standard one and press read. Then insert standard two and press read again. You're now ready to begin reading each of your samples. Insert your first sample and press read. To calculate your stock concentration, select Calculate Stock Concentration, adjust the volume of sample used, and save the calculation. You can continue reading samples by pressing Read Next Sample. The fluorescent absorbance of your sample is plotted on the two-point standard curve. The assay tube concentration does not take into account your dilution factor, so be sure to use the calculate function. When you have read your last sample, press data on the lower right hand side of the screen. You can export to the Invitrogen thumb drive using the thumb drive button. Press home twice to return to the main screen.